He made me record into a thing. Hey, oh, Kurt, look at this here. Shut up. What? Oh. 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 You come wow. in like a bull. I know. I didn't expect any of this. Just clubbing <laughs> through everything. <laughs> Banging into the table. <laughs> and me I'm and Mesco wore the same outfit. Out. Only one man can survive in this Louis C.K. outfit. Oh, you I guys got a V-neck? <laughs> Holy shit, dude. This, first of all, I mean, this is my fault for fighting on Twitter with a guy from Portland named Toby. And I do admit <laughs> you that. You realize <laughs> you already I lost. Admit, <laughs> I do admit a guy named Toby. <laughs> I should have went, oh, Toby from Portland. I should just not even. I'm trying not to engage anymore. You let people. Portland Toby get you? Toby. But, dude, the shit, but the, the, the shit that comes out of their heads is like drain. Like, I, I'm like two years older now since the beginning what of the happened? day. What happened with Toby from Portland? All right, so, you know, this started some fucking dude, Evan, who I barely know. Evan from Portland? <laughs> He's no. a great guy. Before you tell, uh, no. Before you tell a story. He's I a lot more reasonable than Toby. I need you to figure out your technical issues before you start the story. No, you don't. Hold on. I'm Just put the plastic bag down, because that's I yeah, getting you, picking you, up in the microphone. Look, you, you can't do all of your electronics at once. Just hold He's on. He's got a cell phone, <laughs> his electronic cigarette, no, I gotta, his iPad. I got to I got to fucking. We're going to come back from break. He's trying to take apart a giant ball of rubber bands. <laughs> Sorry, guys. I have a lot of things I have to get done today. That's your, put down your soldering iron <laughs> Dude, I, I, and join the conversation. I've been procrastinating. All of these things. <laughs> so, <laughs> Matthew's showing what a genius he is. He can, uh, he can untie cr the craziest of knots while he tells jokes. All right. So listen, this is what happened, and this is what jerk off I am too, by the way. Uh, some some guy, Evan Jones. You know him? Oh, Evan Leslie yeah. Jones. Evan Leslie Jones. Yeah. Evan Leslie Jones. He came on here and timidly argued with us about Naked Show once. Yeah. Oh yeah. Well, I'm gonna do that tomorrow with Caitlin and uh, what's her name, Clamp. Good. Good. Way T to set him up for a fall. Or as we call them, tits and tits. Well, I, I, like, dude, I, I, this is what made me laugh. By I the bet way. me and you have similar takes on the theme. I just, <laughs> oh, I mean, well, I guess the theme was always black. Well, that's I your was question. going with that Kurt, theme. Under any circumstances in the world, would you ever do a naked show? Under why any would it, why, I'll isn't, throw it, a price isn't tag? it hard enough? Isn't it fucking hard enough to tell a goddamn joke to these fucking morons without that on top of it? Why? Why would you add all that right, distraction right. to that's a job that already is too hard? He's really up here right now. Because this is. How do you have any fans? I was gonna call him. I was gonna call him a dick. But he looks way too up, up uppity right now. Wait, so look, wait, let me tell you what the guy tweeted. He's gonna so. hit me in the face today. No, it's just I why uh, like I, I fucking I, I know I'm not alone with this. I tweeted somebody else. No, no, no I, we've had this argument you? on our it's show. It's fucking before. stupid, precious, cutesy shit, and I hate it. So I, we're I, just you saying want? you're saying it with the energy like you're fucking trying to combat. Because I gotta like, it's a thing that should be obvious that you're just uh, Jenny from Forrest Gump doing her dumb song naked, and you think it's art and it's not. It should just be obvious, but it's not. Caitlin Bailey is gonna die of AIDS. That's well, wait, fact. before you read this, yeah. let me tell you the take I had on the whole thing. I said nobody, everybody that comes to that show, every dude who comes to that show, straight male, is coming to see pussy. And I disagreed with that. They don't dude. give a shit about a comedy show. They don't care about what's gonna be funny. I, or I, I, I disagree with this because I've seen the show. Let me Jay, tell you her response. Jay, she goes, I've seen the show well, and I went to the show and I didn't go there just to see pussy. I went were there you to see dicks. No, I went there to see people be nervous and doing comedy. Yeah, dude. I uh, listen. I, I get. I get. I didn't. That. By the way, I didn't I come get from Manhattan show. to watch the show. No, no. I happen to be I here. I get the freak show. I went show. in the room. Listen, I, I get the freak show spectacle of it. I would never be a part of that horse shit. Yeah, of course. Well, I wonder what that's going to be okay, like. Okay, can I just ask you? Why would you be a part Kurt, of that? I don't even completely disagree with you, but yeah. you're so angry. Let me try to get you angry out. <laughs> why? I, I'm, I am. No, I am. Just, just your dumb voice just did it. Uh -huh. Just hearing your voice say that. Well, I'm sorry. I'll try. I'll try to not talk the next time you come on my no, podcast. Why do you hear this Twitter shit I had to deal the with? The irony of that, the irony of that is everyone says Dave sounds exactly like Kurt. Kurt hates his sound. <laughs> I do. Kurt's, Kurt's actually just dreaming his own uh, words. That's, that's what gives him night terrors. That's, why, like, that's why you live your life on Facebook because you hate your own voice. Just Kurt. get off my lawn. That's, that's my <laughs> message to all of you. Get your dumb fucking five-year comedy bullshit off my fucking lawn. The balls there in my... The balls. Listen, listen to me. I, I don't even it like... It is impossible to I not don't listen. Even, you are screaming. I don't even <laughs> want... Like, like, just so you understand where I'm at. No, no, I don't no. even want to... Turn my headphones down. I don't even want to see a fucking Latino show. So that's how much I'm against the theme show. I do agree with you. I like the idea of just doing a stand-up show. I think there's way too many themes. But I don't know what people do what they want to do. I don't know why you're so it's angry about it. Because I... It's, you know what? I, well, it, let me hear the, it, it's an obvious... Let's hear the interaction. Stupid. I want to hear Evan and I want to hear Toby. I want to know what happened here. Wait, can you read Evan's parts and I'll read yours? 
No, no, no. It's not a thing versus Evan. Shut up, Evan. Dummy. No, no. Dumbass. This is. Thank no, you. No. Hold on. Thank you. I'm Prove my point. My Thank you. You want to? Oh, uh, you want to take off your clothes and then tell jokes? Oh, can is that what they do there? I tell the story. Caitlin Bell, you're dumb. Why are you so pissed off at us? None of your voices are measurably different than mine on any level. <laughs> I was just doing. I was just doing your voice. We were just all doing an impression of you. Let me finish the goddamn story. Please. Okay. It's fucking irritating to hear you just talk about the naked. Holy shit. All right. You started talking about the naked show. I know. I'm drained from this day. Okay? <laughs> I'm fucking drained. We had but no plans of talking about this. Kurt. <laughs> well, here's how we were going to talk about Jimmy Superfly Snooker. You came you in on a down. mission. Hold on. You sat down and went, naked show. Hold Fuck on. that. I yeah. should have known, by the way, he was untangling those cords. Let, he didn't let, talk hold about on. It. Let me tell you what happened. I want to hear it so all. So Evan Joe, so he goes, mm -hmm. I go, just come on. I go, you can say whatever you want. Nobody's going to try to hurt you. None of that shit. Come on the show. Very friendly. Okay. But did you use like a, a <laughs> No one's going to try to hurt you? Kurt, I know from your perspective. That sounds friendly. Would you like but to see what like I wrote? Every my show, no one's going to hurt you. robs you says that before they rob you. Yeah. Go, Come here, I'm not going to rob listen, you. Like, yeah, they shut said the fuck up. Honest to God, it was perfectly <laughs> friendly, you dumb shit. Not like now that you're annoying me. It was perfectly Kurt, friendly. Fuck you, Kurt. What's your Holy attitude for? I was making a I had my people life, laughed at. Dude, I had my cares. life Kurt, drained. It's a Twitter war. What are it you really fucking losing your shit over? Let me tell you the best part. We're almost on your side, dickface. Let me tell you the best part of this. I, I want to just fucking smash my face through a brick wall. Like, I, I, honestly, God, I'm in a shit mood from just this shit. From Toby? All right, can you, hold on, can you breathe for a minute? Oh, stop Please. telling me to fucking breathe. No, breathe. I just like the whole goddamn day. Relax. Fuck breathe. face. You're, you're fucking. I, I, dude. Yes, Kurt, you have to breathe the whole Kurt, day. That's Kurt, how you live. I'm going right? to put it's a not... shotgun in my mouth. <laughs> I'm a little on edge right now, dude. Oh, my God, I've never seen you like this. <laughs> Even out here on the West Coast. We're on the West Coast. We got the fucking sun. We got all the uh, the, the beautiful women, the, the le legal weed, and the happiness. But as I was starting the show, we just showed up here. Um, my arch nemesis, <laughs> Kurt Metzger. Yeah, I, it was. R this all went down like Lewis and Kurt. I mean, they, w they didn't like get in each other's face. It was really just Kurt cursing him out. And then just like in the backdrop of Kurt screaming that he's going to kill Lewis is the line for the show. And just everybody here is just like right before the show. Like if you think that anything we are putting on any like bit of a character or persona on this show, it is exactly like that off stage. Yeah. yeah. It's it's terrible. So Kurt, if you guys don't know, I'll catch up real quick. Kurt Metzger is a faggot. And that can't just be the story. Yeah, he sucks. Well, he's building. Yeah, he's uh, yeah, he's a fucking no, no, no. Uh, a few months ago, uh, we did a show with Big J, and while I was on stage, Kurt Metzger decided that my time was over. On wait, the show. wait, 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 wait. What? Let me give. Can I give just one beginning of the story? Uh, Lewis hey, killed uh, Kurt Metzger's kid that day. <laughs> <laughs> no, there was a phone call made. Said, "Hey J, you want to uh, headline the was it the Irvine Improv? What was it?" Brea, you want to headline the Brea? <laughs> you guys know this story? <laughs> so just not even. That's uh, just great. Uh, 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 that goes, matters. Kurt was wearing a blue shirt, and they go green, greenish <laughs> blue. Uh, <laughs> but <laughs> never mind. I get what you're saying, blue. Uh, Broad you know strokes, blue. But they were you know, pants. Like, you want to come headline the Brea up. Improv? I go, oh yeah. You know it'd be great. Kurt lives out in L.A. now. Lewis is gonna be out there with me. I'll get my two buddies in the show. It's gonna be so much fun. Then, then go ahead, Lewis. Jay like came to the show with three matching uh, best friends T-shirts to like give out. It's like this it is gonna be the best hang ever. It was a three-way broken heart. I was the uh, half the E and the S and the I and the E. Yeah. So long story short, Metzger fucking lit me while I was on stage because he decided my time was over and it was his time to go up. It ended up being a whole fucking thing. We started screaming at each other, and me and Metzger. You're paraphrasing a bit. Yeah, a little bit. Well, I don't want to fucking read. You know, tell the whole story. I guess we didn't get up on here, right? So yeah, so we start screaming at each other. He leaves, and then starts sending me psychotic text messages through the night about what he would have done to me if I got into his face again. And then I start sending him psychotic text messages back. And, and it what's got great about Lewis and Kurt talking shit through text is they both have voices that you can really hear through text. <laughs> you know what I mean? Oh like yeah. if you get a text from Kurt, you don't just get a text from Kurt. Like you read it like, do you really think you're gonna talk to me like that? In my face? And then and then you read a text from Lewis and it's very like, I'll break your face right now. Right. You like, think you, know? you can talk to me like that? You know, like, when you read a book, you just hear it in your own voice. But then when you read the book of someone who you've seen speak before, you kind of read it in their voice. It's like that. <laughs> yeah, so, it, and it got heated, and we have not spoken since. 
Um, and I didn't really even talk about it that much on the show. We just kind of we, we well, really, we, they all knew where it happened. You know, so I it must about have it, been discussed I somewhere. I talked about it extensively on the show. Actually, <laughs> never mind. A couple couple shows. And, uh, <laughs> you did three full yeah, hour long so, breakdowns. Some would it. describe it as an expose. <laughs> and yeah, Lewis first Kurt, the Zapruder films. <laughs> you know, and uh, so we haven't spoken. So I see that he's on the fucking lineup here tonight, and I told Jay, I was like, dude. I don't even want to fucking see this guy. We haven't spoken. I know he's just going to be disrespectful, and I'm going to end up fucking smacking him in his mouth. And then it's good approach. he sees me as I'm walking in. He tries to, like, make a joke. He says, I just kind of ignore him because, like, I'm just going to, I'm, I'm sort of my show. And then I come up here, and then my fucking girlfriend comes up, and she's like, she's like, oh, yeah, don't go out there. Kurt Metzger is really losing his shit. Like, Which what is what, what such a dirty Kim Puerto Rican move to do. <laughs> she absolutely wanted to see her boyfriend fight. He just goes out there. Whatever you do, don't go in the parking lot right now. You'll probably get fucked uh, up. Stay, uh, stay inside, Poppy. They're going to kick your <laughs> shit outside if you go out there. They talking mad shit. They not scared of you or nothing. <laughs> they saw you got bitch in your heart. <laughs> Go get a drink with me, Maricon. <laughs> she really is a fucking awful piece of garbage. <laughs> That's She's why like, you guys yeah, are perfect. Go there. So then I immediately, I was like, what do you mean? Do I, I, of course I'm going to go out there. And then I get out there, and Jay and Dave both grab me dramatically. They're like, no, no, no you got to go. I'm like, what, what is going on? What is he saying in front of my fans? <laughs> Just trashing me in front of a line of people about to see me. And you guys aren't even going to fucking tell me. You're going to let me come up here like a bitch, and these people aren't going to respect me. So now I have to fuck this bitch up. Well, listen. So I texted him. I said, here, I'll tell you. Here, if you guys want to read it. Here, I'll tell you. You guys, if you want to read it. Jay, do you want to be me and Dave can be Kurt? Yeah. So I'm blue. This is just now. Okay. Jay, you're going to be me? Okay, I'm in blue. I'll see the blue. Okay. Heard you were, out, heard you were outside <laughs> talking NGN shit. That's is it the first that when Lewis is angry, he, oh, he's thumbs. riddled with typos at his sex. <laughs> you think you could just shim a lemma shim bam to me? <laughs> Wama lemma bing bing. Yeah. Why don't you QWERTY my balls, you shum blam 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 Let me, actually, you, you do Kurt. You, no, you, you I don't do want to do Kurt. Kurt. You do Kurt. Oh, uh, there's too much Kurt to do. It's oh, all great. Kurt. No, it's great. Kurt wrote you back a fucking so, no, no, essay. Read the second line. Oh, the second line. Here's Lewis. So come back, you fucking faggot. <laughs> but hey, feel how you will about the approach. No spelling errors in that one. So pretty. <laughs> fucking nailed the second text, motherfuckers. <laughs> Uh, I don't know. I don't know if I can keep up. I calmed down on yeah. that second one. I fucking long. thought about it. This is this is too long, but got to do a spot. To be honest, when I think about it, Jay and Christine acting like I somehow did something wrong <laughs> makes me even more enraged. <laughs> I'm gonna stab Jay. Whoa, dude. Turns in. Nah, I made that part up. It's not in the text. That's uh. uh Everybody's getting stabbed. <laughs> you owe me an apology, plain and simple. The light thing was a simple misunderstanding. <laughs> Duh. I don't know. I can't. I lose the curve. Read the next line. Yeah. Well, Read like the next line. So I'll be back at 11:30. Yeah. <laughs> all right. It is uh, nine. It's oh, nine so p.m. Much there's, more. I can't do all of this, Lewis. It's. I mean, there's literally. I'm not even exaggerating. There's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine more attacks. This is. Regard. Look at the psycho that I'm dealing with, by the way. <laughs> look at him. Look at him. Yeah, Lewis. Yeah. Lewis. Yes, he you're, has, bo uh, you're both dealing with psychos. <laughs> that's that's why this problem is here. I promise you that I am more psycho than Kurt Metzger. Wait, hold on. We Lewis, to take responsibility this text message is between you and you. <laughs> you <were> just, <laughs> Lewis, you were just texting yourself all of this stuff. Lewis, if you this change, if you just change the accent uh, on each thing, it would make sense also. Um. Well, all right, so look, apparently he's coming back, and uh, he promised Andy that he's not going to attempt to start a fight, but I owe him an apology. And he goes, I'll be back at 1130. By then, I'll be calmer, but I'm warning you fair, which is a weird way to put it. <laughs> I'm warning you fair. I'm war warning you fair? What are you, Kurt, what type of fight are you in? Are you going to take 12 paces and shoot? A fair. <laughs> don't ever jump I'm in my you face. Fair. Don't ever jump in my face like that again. All right, I'm getting worked up again. I got to stop. <laughs> So if you're there when, when I get back, we can handle it how you choose. How's that sound? Fair? Maybe before 11.30 if I finish early, but my spot is 11.30. 
Then I wrote, cool, got it. See you at 1130. Can I be honest with you? I'm going, hold on, make this very clear. Sure, sure. I'm going to beat the shit out of Kurt Metzger in the comedy cellar or the comedy store parking lot at 1130. I promise you. I, I promise you. I, I swear, swear to God, God Lewis. I swear to God, okay. I'm going to fight him. Do you no, understand? I'm fighting him tonight. That if you just assume, tonight, you literally just changed the level of the crime that it is by <laughs> declaring it on a podcast <laughs> before you did it. As, as not your lawyer, but the closest thing that you have to a lawyer. Jew. A, a Jew who's in your life. A tall New York Jew. This I have to please tell you that that is not a good idea to announce out loud. I'm going to beat him up. It's premeditated. Ha ha. Guys, it's all part of the bet. Lewis, I can't believe you're acting like this on button-down shirt night. Whoa, 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 Jay. That short sleeve button down short shirt. Short sleeve button down right? shirt. Now you came it's here a right from doing different night. You came here right from doing IT work, and you're all <laughs> goofed let's, up. Let's get our first guest up here because we have some great up. guests. And to be honest Wait, with you, me with say. with the, you know the the theme of tonight now. Wait, obviously but let me say before you bring the guest up. That the problem with what's happening with this 11:30 time. He says, I'll be there at 11.30, which you can't wait for. You're, can't wait. you're so excited for 11.30. Counting down the minutes. Then he goes, or maybe earlier if they move my spot. But as of now, my spot is 11.30, which means it's he will impossible. not be here at 11.30. Midnight's the earliest he can get here. That's right. So, you know, rest. <laughs> I, uh, no one's going to – it's going to get broken up. Because no one's going to What? I'm with him. He's, he's alpha and you. Right you didn't really <laughs> stick up for him out there. I'm getting worked out. I'm sorry, Dave. You're right. It's not about you. It's not against you. But uh, so Jay also said to me, <laughs> Jay was like, he was like, dude, what you're doing is you're putting me in a situation because if you and Kurt fight, now you're getting me and Dave in like a physical thing where we have to jump in. I was like, first of all, Dave will start hitting Kurt as well. well Dave's did, my nigga. He just said okay? jump in. He wasn't specific. <laughs> Dave, me and out. Dave are fucking ride or die. So you got to pick a team, motherfucker. <laughs> Uh, Dave's not None gonna just attack gonna Kurt. I. <laughs> you don't think that Dave would start putting his fucking thumb into Kurt's neck if he's pulling us apart? I mean, Lewis. I like. I know him. We've met, but we're not particularly close. I'm not gonna put a thumb in a guy's neck. <laughs> <laughs> no. Uh, yeah. Look, Lewis. I would try to stop you guys from fighting. What if Andy started screaming really loud? Would you count that as her jumping in? And then you start jumping him, right? Wait. Are you, you guys? Guys, guys, <laughs> guys put your hands together if you're willing to jump Kurt Metzger with me. I'm not fighting Kurt Metzger. We're jumping Kurt Metzger <laughs> as a fucking gang. <laughs> you need uh, fucking mind, Kurt Metzger. You cross me. We need Legion of Skanks certified with the government like the Juggalos. <laughs> <laughs> Goddamn right. Goddamn right. All right, let's bring our guest. All right, let's bring up our first Hell guest. Yeah. Where the fuck is that bitch, Kurt Metzger? <laughs> Don't escalate it, Lewis. Where is he? He's in the house. I heard he's in the building. This is, I know you think this is theater, but it's like pretty, yeah, pretty close drop. to real. You have one for talking shit, one for dropping. <laughs> He's in the building. He's in the building right now. If you guys were not here in the first half, He's working. tonight is the night Sit that down, me and shit, Kurt Metzger Ed. finally fight. It's a night. Yeah, I'm excited for it. It's been a long time coming. Kurt Metzger has never had respect for me. He's never fucking shown me respect. You too, Dave. Wait, hold on. He hasn't respected me. Or I don't respect you. Both of you don't respect me, <laughs> and he doesn't respect you. I've also never. Respected Lewis, if you're gonna you. fight everybody, who doesn't respect you, man. <laughs> Train again. <laughs> Jay, mm -hmm. I'm not gonna take your ribbing tonight, okay? This, these fans did not come for ribbing of Lewis J. Gomez. They came for fighting of Kurt Metzger. What do you think? No, they. they what is this podcast? If we take out the Lewis ribbing, it's pretty much just us reading ads. <laughs> what? Yeah, I also took a blue. A I, it's an awesome I took a blue chew before this show, so I'm gonna fight him with a boner. Yeah, <laughs> it's the only combo that makes you hard now. He he and can't. I'm wearing my heshy sock. <laughs> <laughs> I'm wearing my heshy sock on my dick. I also can't be knocked over now. I have a boner. I'm like a jack. <laughs> I'm like a, you know, like jacks. Come on, guys. I'm standing up, dog. I don't know when he's going to fucking come through this door, and I got to be, I, I'm not going to wait until he starts barking and talking shit. As soon as I make eye contact with him, I'm going to be like, hey, dude, I'm going to shake his hand. And when he goes to shake my hand, boom! <laughs> what, were you a professional wrestler? What type of strategy? <laughs> and then, kick to the stomach, stone-cold stunner. 
That motherfucker. Did you done. hear Lewis defeated Kurt with an Irish whip into the ropes, <laughs> followed by a devastating body spear? Small package finish in the third. <laughs> Got to say a special shout out right now to LA Speedweeds in the house, guys. Come on, oh, give us yeah. some love. Yeah. The vape that I'm smoking right now came from LA Speedweed. These guys, they're the fucking best, dude. They came with packages for everybody. The interns, they give the interns packages. Nobody gives the interns things. Why do we never get them? I feel like you take them all. What? Do they give them to you and say distribute these amongst your friends? What? <laughs> <laughs> what did you say, huh? Sit down, you weirdo. This is awkward as shit. Were you standing up? It's not awkward, dude. I'm getting my blood flowing to my legs. You understand? The thing is, because you've never fought in a professional MMA fight. Neither of you! <laughs> <laughs> it's Ellis Mania! It was close enough. Three, three minute rounds. You gotta get the oxygen to your legs, dog. If I start sitting down now, not gonna be good. Okay. Did All you right. sit did you see me sit between rounds when I beat up Brian O'Neill? I don't think so. That's true. Undefeated. Undefeated. Yeah. Black belt killer. <laughs> Fucking black belt killer, motherfucker. Do you think I am afraid of fucking erratic cokehead Kurt Metzger when I'm a blackhead killer? In your fucking mind? Where is he? Get him in here! I like that, uh, Get him in here. Lewis gave Kurt Metzger like a Trump nickname. <laughs> so you, do you really trust erratic Kurt? <laughs> Jay, you don't fucking mock me, dude. You know what's going on. I also, here's what happened. He came in earlier tonight. For the, we'll do a re, you know, recap for the people who are not at the earlier show. I saw him out back and I ignored him because I know that he's a fucking lunatic. And I was like, if I deal You just with got ignored by the Puerto Rican rattlesnake. <laughs> S- step, <laughs> step two, yelling. <laughs> Consider that a real ass ignorance. <laughs> I ignored him, and I was like, I'm not going to even deal with it. I got a show about to start. I got a line full of fucking uh, stanks I appreciate waiting to that. get in this I place. I was right. Yeah, so then I, the, I passed. I was like, dude, I'm not going to fucking lower myself to that. I walk in, and he makes some comment as I walk in. I'm like, let me just fucking ignore him. So then I go It's actually, t- it's really sitting in, settling in with me now, but ignoring someone was actually the most adult thing I've ever seen you do. Yeah. I was, I was proud a, of you. Just the silent treatment. <laughs> well, because I ignored him. Then he just berated me in front of the line of people waiting to come and see me, saying I'm not funny and I'm a hack and I'm fucking garbage. He didn't and say any of that, but he did say that. I didn't hear him say any of those. My girlfriend told me specifically that's what he said. She's trying to make you fight. By the way, <laughs> and, and you know what's really funny? She's trying to make you fight, and she picked insults that Kurt did not say. <laughs> yeah. I was there, so I don't know where you've got a little a dick. You from. can't fuck good. <laughs> 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 Everything else was dead on. <laughs> I kept waiting to defend you, and I'd go, all right, right. <laughs> Shit, he's right. <laughs> I'm like, all right, well, don't be a dick about it. <laughs> but uh, no, he didn't say anything about you. Also, I think, by the way, I think the drummer from Orgy is in the house. See here? <laughs> Fuck yeah, doggy. Oh, hell yeah, dude. Dude, I just think that's the coolest thing in the world. The drummer from Orgy hit me up. He's like, dude, I'm a huge fan of yours. I was like, dude, I fucked my girlfriend in high school to your music. Dude. <laughs> He's a big fan of you? Yeah, yeah, yeah. How does it feel? <laughs> feel like you do. I thought you were a drummer. And a f- I came to see the skanks. <laughs> Tell me now, how do I feel? Oh, I That's what I'm going to do. I'm going to sing to Kurt Metzger after I'm beating him up. <laughs> how does it feel? You're getting a little obsessed with it, dude. That's odd. You really brought it back there for no reason. Do you guys enjoy the sun out here? Like Nothing like blood do. on your knuckles in the sunlight. <laughs> Kurt Metzger's blood. How, how are you going to feel? I thought he was if, there. Uh, you looked right there. I was like... <laughs> 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 he's not Papa Shango. He's, uh, <laughs> Just black blue <laughs> starts falling from my head. He's, like, yeah, he's in the rafters like Sting. <laughs> 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 Take me back. What was the first coarse word spoken? Were they from you or him? That night? Yeah. On the initial thing, who was the first person who first blew up? First coarse words spoken. I remember what his reaction was. So he lit me. It's, it's a little inside baseball. He lit me at a comedy show when he was supposed to go next. Which all agree are, is weird. It's weird. You're not supposed to do that. It's not his job. So he flashed his cell phone because he was like, all right, you're done doing jokes. My turn. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> You can't I'm get hyped over, over something that wasn't actually said. That's what he said in his head. My turn, done. 
You stink. I hope your kid dies. My turn. You ain't shit. Your kid sucks. <laughs> Go back to Puerto Rico. <laughs> Lewis is, all Lewis is doing right now is trying to work himself yeah. up to fight. But, wait, he's just but getting lit means like your time's up now. Your time's yeah, up. Yeah, yeah. Okay. Like a club so Kurt decided So it would be early. like someone unplugging a band. Yes. yes. Imagine you're about to fight. Not, 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 not unplugging, but making Imagine for somebody, charity. the next band came in and unplugged your microphone while you were in the middle of a song. No, well, it's not. That's the that's extreme. Jamie. Lewis, here's what the, are they here's like, the flaw in your it analogy. It depends what genre they are. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> They're hip hop. You're like, yeah, carry on. <laughs> <laughs> no, no, it's fine. We'll go a little less. <laughs> The analogy can't be unplugging his microphone when well, we are in a situation that also involves a microphone. Yes, like, that would be also like unplugging <laughs> your microphone. What yeah. he did was the equivalent of getting like a uh, very visible eye shot of you and making sort of like, you know, a gesture of telling what you is the giving you like a wrap up. If you have to wrap it up, if you have to wrap up a show early, right before your set's done, what would happen? How would, would a stage manager come out and be like, dude, you gotta stop? Like, what yeah. would happen? And you just keep playing. You're just like, fuck you, dude. And then you curse him out, be like, dude, this yeah. stage manager's a bitch. And people throw shit at him. Yeah, yeah, it's yeah. It's great. Well, yeah, Kurt Metzger was that stage manager. Okay. Well, as comedians, the way you handle it is you just get off stage. So that's what Lewis Comics did. Comics are fucking pussies. And that's but what the were the first? Today. You came back very hot about it. I told you. I didn't come back very talk hot. Talk to him. About, yeah, you did. Yes, you did. Oh, you about, fucking psycho. <laughs> yeah, you did. You walked well, in and you go, hold on. Are you grading on a Lewis curve? Or oh. are you no, comparing in, Lewis he, to the average person? He came in at a Lewis 4, which is a human like 11. <laughs> Wait, are you? Wait, wait, wait. Can everybody you, see the, the snot bubble that just blew out of my nose? That was brutal. <laughs> are you Team Metzger? No. No. I'm, I'm not Team Metzger. I'm Team this whole thing doesn't Jay, happen. Jay, what? So you don't, so you're you have to pick both. a gun to your head. Yeah. You have to help one dude jump the other. Gun is to your head. It's the strangest killer ever. <laughs> and he's here to make you pick. He's a weird pervert. <laughs> it's a ridiculous thing. Uh, in front of you, I'll say you. <laughs> and in front of Kurt, I'll say Kurt. Who's going to challenge that later? <laughs> I bet he told Kurt, hey. Kurt when he went home. Um, no, I hope it doesn't happen at all, but I don't think it's going to. But I really, uh, but uh, I'd like to know that. What happened? What was the first? So you went out, I told so you to talk to him, and you said, okay, I'll talk to him. So he goes, he goes like this. He goes, hey, man, you got a light? Because <laughs> he was like, he was completely unaware that there was even a problem. So right. then I'm like, yeah, yeah, dude, I are, you not, are you not in a hurry to leave? Because I assume he had to be in a huge hurry to fucking go to another show, right? He wouldn't just light me in the middle of my joke to be a cunt, <laughs> right? He had to be somewhere. So I get off stage, and, I, uh, and, and I'm like, oh, you don't have to go anywhere? He's like, no, I'm hugging out. So I'm like, I was like, dude, well, why would you light me? Like, why, why would you? And this, this calm. calm. This calm. This is the tone. Why would you, you light well, me? Well, Curtis, let me inquire. <laughs> Mr. Metzger, you? if you would just give me a moment of your time, respectfully. Why would you do such a thing? I would like to gain <laughs> audience with you, sir. So wait, he has another show, and he can just go to it? He didn't have another show. He didn't oh. have another show. But you do multiple shows in one night. Sometimes. That's not what's yeah, going on yeah. here. This was just the show we did. This just a, this was a, we, I assumed he had another show, and he didn't. So he just did it to be a cunt. So I said, I was like, why would you do that? So then I see him kind of... He did it because he thought... By, by me cutting his time, because he showed up late, that's what happened, we put Kim on, we had time, so I told him, I don't, I don't want to go on the show an hour into the show, so I said, you're going to do 20 minutes instead of 25, because he got there late. And I think he assumed that meant there was a show afterwards that we had to wrap up quick. So his, what he stands by is that he thought Lewis was cutting into what his time would be. But that's not the case. And that's not what would have happened. And but still, even There's a lot of math in that. Even it's still yeah. the same story. It was right. Before even under those circumstances, that. lighting Lewis was a weird thing to do for sure. Uh, but I said I would describe the whole thing as like uh, Kurt doing a weird thing and Lewis Lewising out about it. <laughs> and you have two lunatics who are not just going to have me and Lewis have had knockdowns. So let me tell you what, can I tell what his beat. What would happen? What he said? Sure. So I was like, I was like, well, do you have to? You don't have to go anywhere. Why, why would you light me? And he waits a beat, and he goes, he goes, you guys owe me $100 from the Comedy Store show I did six months ago. Uh, in his defense, we didn't pay him on that show. Uh, it's true. Well, actually, in his defense, we donate, everyone donated their money to the Puerto Rico Hurricane Relief Charity. It's so um, gay. And he just... <laughs> just seemed like the right thing to do at the terrible. time. Bad idea. I could have used that money. 
Um, but he ran out. But it had nothing to do with the conversation. It was just a fucking bizarre thing to even fucking bring up. That was like, so I'm, I'm going like, so you think you have the right to fucking just cut my time short because we owe you money from a show a year ago? Are you out of your fucking mind? So then it started to escalate, and then... My point being, like, there's no way near it's that it's near this tone. What? Yeah, no, your, your retell the story tone is always like 10 levels below what you were actually doing at the time. I know you, bro. I don't care. Fuck him. See, it's but more I'm like that. I that's raped getting, his mother. What? Closer. That's what I did. That's how it started. Fuck him and fuck his family. But I'm and saying, we're there. That's what it was. Fuck him. Where, that's where fuck him. See, it only took a little I bit of prodding. I don't give a fuck what happened before the fucking incident. <laughs> Suck my fucking dick. I fucking fucked his mom and her ass. What? Do something, bitch. Where is he? I can't wait till that whiskey goes on your dick. Give me more I, uh, whiskey. It's, I think the whole thing's a wash, buddy. He's you don't think gone. he's even going to come up here? I think he's probably gone, quite honestly. Which, uh, you know, good. Well, that's what I'm certainly rooting for. <laughs> Dave, you not even a little bit you want to see me punch Kurt Metzger in his face? Oh, yeah, like 15, 20%. But then you think about <laughs> cops and getting someone getting hurt. Probably not a good idea. Yeah. Um. <laughs> <laughs> right, doggy? Even the fucking oh, yeah. libertarians in the crowd are like, you know what, dude, one day. <laughs> oh, yeah. We're going to put. We're no, gonna put look, our horse I get where you're aside. coming from. If I was just at a show watching someone else, I'd absolutely want him to fight this other guy on the show. I would whisper to everybody around, right. he goes, I hope these two fucking rock, man. <laughs> but with an emotional investment, I hope you it know, does not happen. Interns, is, not is Kurt Metzger still in the house? I'm also on a podcast where Lewis is announcing he's going to assault another human being. I feel like the cops are going to want to ask me I questions you, at some point. Yeah, there's going to be some sticky I'm litigation. I'm not going to assault him. I will let him assault me. And then That's I not a very good fight strategy. Beat the shit out of him. <laughs> You're gonna rope a dope him? <laughs> <laughs> You're gonna let him punch himself out and come on strong in the Yeah. <laughs> By the way, cut scene, he's he just doesn't understand my cardio. And I peg him in the face with a glass. <laughs> he's twenty feet away from the stage. You're almost certainly gonna miss and hit one of our fans yeah. the show. In fact, you're drunk enough to start. How cool would that be about about How cool would that be if I hit you in the face with a fucking glass? Right? Tony, you uh, we're talking about all these crazy beefs tonight, you know. Tony's just the one. Crazy beefs. <laughs> just the one. <laughs> You're sending these... mean texts back and forth with it's Kurt Metzger. Are it's you a not, crazy beef. Are you not reading texts? Because it sounds to me, Metzger's texting me that he... It sounds like a calm, let's talk. I have more texts. Ooh. Whoa. Uh-oh. Right, he goes, I'm going to get food. What's your deal? I'm going to Kearney's next door, like a block up, the train car. Wow, you guys really will have crazy beef together. <laughs> <laughs> it's funny because Kearney is such a dog shit place. So if you really know how shitty that beef is at that train car, it's incredible. Well, hold on, hold on, hold on. Yeah. What is your deal? Is your show done? Well, text me, I guess. Actually, Saddle Ranch, which is closer. <laughs> what? Are it's you guys literally right next door? It's like a oh, saved a lot of line. Oh, I was on the trail for a while. Is this is you guys setting up a fight? And he's like, I'm just gonna stop for a sandwich, and then I want to fist fight you when I get back. Does he not know that I want to fight him? Listen, oh, man. he's flipping out, and then he's getting away from it, and not. Hyping up a crowd Lu with fight talk. Lu so yeah, he's, he's probably handling cooled it off. weird. Lewis is like, I want to fight you, doggy. And he's like, let's have a hot doggy. <laughs> that reminds me, let's get dogs. <laughs> Carnies, what a terrible place. Saddle Ranch is even sadder. You guys could ride the bull together or something like that. Just fucking yeah. really just fucking make love by the end of the night. Not butt fuck. I've heard a lot of the butt fucking dick sucking jokes tonight. I think you and Kurt should truly make love. Like yeah, I candle. think you should talk. I think you should talk. I'm not going to talk to him. Call him on speakerphone right now. Okay. Now, now, right now, right now, if I may. Now is a good time to remind all of you, LA Legion of Skanks fans, that I host a weekly podcast in the main room. Every Monday, and I like and I like chaos. And uh, it was my idea to call him on speakerphone every <laughs> Monday at eight. Look, I'm, 
Look, let's I'm do not. <laughs> hold on, hold on, hold on. Guys, listen. You can't speakerphone. Lewis, you got. Do it. Do it. Do no. it. Lewis. You can oh, call, man, but you so can't excited by a chant. I don't care. Guys, Fizz. listen to me. I'm you not can gonna... call, but you can't speakerphone. I'm not going to call him on speakerphone. Hello? Lewis. Hello? Huh? Can you hear me? Yeah, I can hear you. Take him off speakerphone. Hey, hey. I'm at Saddle Ranch. <laughs> I know. I'm in the middle of a show, and everyone's expecting you to come and fight me. Yes! Yes! Uh, Lewis has to sit over here. Yeah. You gotta switch seats, though, if we're gonna, if we're gonna bring Kurt on. Hello? Come over here right now. Oh! Oh! Dude, dude, Lewis, Lewis. All right, all right, all right. Switch seats. Oh, wait, wait a second. Was that an official seat switch? What's happening here? Why is he not here? He's eating. I'm not calling him. It's call funnier him. if you call him. Whoa. I think you got one of your stompers over here, Lewis. <laughs> Where are you? Put it on speaker. I'm walking to the club right now. Whoa! Lewis, 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 sit down, sit down. Lewis, 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 sit down, stupid. This is sit like down. Rocky Road. Lewis, sit down. Seriously, sit down. This is like you don't a, want to fight right American here. fatiators. Lewis, sit the fuck I, down. I've never seen a vape pen that has calories in it. <laughs> Unbelievable. <laughs> this is very, very exciting. You can feel it it's in tense. the air. It's tense. It's <laughs> tense. It's almost like a weed. It's certainly pen. tense. <laughs> uh, by the way, Jay. So you guys know Jay is sad right now. No, I Jay think it's gonna. Sad. I think it's gonna be. I think this is a better way to do it. It's good. You know, it's. <laughs> and I do. I'm audience. not so yes. sure. No. No, I'm not sure this is better. Then having it happen just out in the street somewhere, I think it's like more likely to get views. But Kurt jumped by 75 people. Uh, no one's going to fucking jump anybody. Doggy, I'm being dead ass. Jump Kurt Mesker if he's winning this fight. Why do you think I'm kidding about There's this? There's no fight. What if he just ends it real quickly and it's already over? There's no fight's going to happen. Well, then you guys have to fucking... Can I mediate it so that I don't have to leave the show? Can he sit here and I'll just like... I'll just like... No, set up another mic. No, you set should sit, you should right sit there and mediate. Yeah, no, I, I, I just... I just, I, just, I, just don't, I just don't want to. I don't want to miss it. <laughs> I don't want to yeah. be back there with the peasants. <laughs> Can we get another Jeez, microphone? Sorry. No, guys, all you got to do is yell, set up another mic, and then they do it. Oh, wow, that's incredible. Look, whoa, there he is. That's, nice. A lot of you don't know, that's Kurt Metzger. He's going to blow Lewis right now. There he goes. What an ending to the story. Lewis, 2-0, and oh, all time. <laughs> all time. Turns out he was a real ass dude. Thank you, Harrington. Yeah, he's already one down. Another, uh, you know, uh, so I'm at the another. whole Kurt fight. I don't think we're going to do the impressions thing anymore. Oh, there he is! It's Kurt Metzger! <laughs> hey. Thank you very much. Uh, I thought Kurt. we said get it done and it gets done. It'll get done. Don't worry, Tony. We got you, baby. <laughs> Lewis, hello. What's up, Kurt? Where, what are we up to now in the story? Because I was planning to read Lewis's text to me on the night in question. Okay, tell, 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 Wait. Tell, tell your version. Tell your version of the story, Kurt. T oh, That's very important. Yes. Okay. So I'm going to do, wh where was it again? The improv where? Brea. <laughs> Brea. I forgot too. Yeah. Uh, so I don't know. I was late. Uh, I believe I spoke to you and you said, okay, we'll just do 20 minutes. You're going to cut your time down because the show's got to end. 
or something to that effect. No, I was saying I didn't want to go on the show late. Oh, I took it as a show had to end, and I thought Sure. About. So uh, I go do my spot. Uh, oh, so Lewis was hosting, right? You know, I want to put Kim or somebody first, and then whatever. I thought, honest to God, Lewis was just high and going overtime, okay? Because I don't really see a host doing 15 minutes when the time I, – I thought the time was short. To be fair, all of Lewis's comedy could be qualified as getting high. Yeah, but uh, listen, I'm not even, listen, I, I, I was laughing at Lewis' shit. It's not even a thing against his shit. Uh, he came off. I did my set. I get off. I'm going out to smoke a joint. Lewis walks by very friendly in the hallway. Uh, he goes, I thought you had to leave. I go, oh, no, man, I have to leave. So right at that moment, he jumps into my fucking face. Don't you ever like me? Okay? Verbatim? Yeah, that's, I'm quoting. That's a fucking quote. But I didn't say shit to it because it's shocking. I didn't see that coming. Shit. So I started making jokes. Listen, I get a nervous reaction. I start making jokes. So I go, Louis J. Gomez. I was going to make a joke about it, the dumb J. He goes, it's Louis J. Gomez, faggot! <laughs> By the yeah. way, this all does all wait, sound wait, wait, like no, this. 100% accurate so far. Okay? But I still, dude, it, it was like. I had no problem with this story. Yeah, it's fucking insane. So, by the way, just a normal human being and a simple misunderstanding with their friend they've known many years might go, hey, man, I don't know, I didn't feel, I like, shouldn't have let me, it hurt my feet, whatever the fuck. And I go, oh, I'm sorry, Lewis, it was not intentional. But Lewis wants to UFC fight it out. First fucking chance he can. I don't know why you'd have a thing to take me down, but I didn't uh, have you're, a rivalry you're, with you. Because you're a cunt and you are, what? You, yeah, you're a, you talk down to people and you don't even fucking realize. Well, Lewis, that's because it. you're incredibly stupid. I, yeah, I'm right, sorry. I'm it, it, I lose my patience. Well, well you're, you're, you're a fucking. You know what? Wait, hold on. And hold I on. Wait, wait. I'm probably going right. to smack the shit wait, out of you. Wait, let me read the fucking Bitch. text, though. Let me read Lewis's text. Read I, let, my text. I don't just want to call him stupid. No. I'm back it up. Jay, you're right. This was the best way to handle this it. This was not. Oh, by the way. Second, it was the second time Lewis had done that. I let it go the first time, which was at the roast battle. Oh, did you let it go, you fucking bitch? Yes, you don't I let did. shit go. I let you go, Lewis, faggot. sit down. How about that? I let you Lewis, go. Lewis, sit down. Lewis, sit down, dude. Well, what are you going to do? Sit down. Well, why don't you make a move and see what I'll do? Whoa, Yo, dude, do dude. Something, dude. Do something, bitch. Do something. What's up, huh? Wow. Yeah. Come on. <laughs> what? You have soaked Tony. Sit still while I read your text. <laughs> what are you doing? You did it that night too? Why are you doing this? You're on my truck. You're a fucking bitch. You're a fucking bitch. You fucking faggot. And we had a weigh in? Will you sit down and do the show? Holy shit. Bitch, you fucking. No, no, no. Stop, 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 stop. No, 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 let's end the show, and I'm going to fuck up Kurt Metzger in the parking lot. What's up? Do something, Kurt. <laughs> you're a Wait, fucking no. bitch. Hey, you're a, hold on. You we, talk I, all I, this I, shit, but you're a fucking bitch. I think we got Lewis, plenty. Lewis, I, we got I plenty think we're a fucking bitch. I think we got you're plenty a of time. Bitch, I want to read your you're text You're a fucking first, bitch. Like that. How about that? End the show. Does you're anyone want to hear Lewis's text? I'm going to fuck you up. No, I think we should, up? I think we should build a... smack the shit out of you, bitch. I be honest. Is it because you know the spelling is hilarious? Smack the shit out of you. Are you trying That's to preempt the spelling of your text? <laughs> <laughs> you Nothing. Nothing. Everybody, yeah, we're gonna end it. Are you that stupid? Let me Don't just. Me, wait, 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 everybody, hold on. We gotta do plugs. <laughs> what in the fuck is wrong? We're in the show. Yeah, let's. let's Everybody, stop, 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 stop. Everybody, f stop. Th thank you so much for coming out. Sorry. This, wait, wait. this went haywire. We appreciate you guys being wait, here. Wait, hold on. Can uh, you tell Louis I got to end the show. Luke, to Kurt, it's just stop. It's, t it's stop. You ran up the stairs when I got here. Louis. He wants a microphone. Get him a microphone. As soon as there's not somebody between us, you're going to stop popping shit. I promise. I thought we were doing a show. No, we're not doing a show. I'm going to fight you, no, faggot. We were oh, doing no. a show, Lewis. What show is this? We were doing hey, a show. I'm going to fight you. Hold on. Can we stop are you with fucking crazy? Lewis, we are no. doing a show. You fucking bitch. Can we I'm going to smack the, the shit out of you, faggot. You told him we were doing a show. I think you guys should have a roast battle. <laughs> Okay, we did do that, and I won it. <laughs> By the way, I.
rest my case. Lewis, don't throw anything. <laughs> Listen, I called down to do the show with you. Do you want to do it or are you that stupid? I, I'm, you're the one that wrong. Call me stupid again. I'm going to fuck you up. Lewis, don't, don't throw I'm anything. Punch him in no, mouth. relax. Kurt, come punch me. The show's over. We're done. I'm going to beat you up right now. Man, I. I I, I feel like the guy that rode in a convertible with Kennedy. <laughs> this is a dangerous spot to be in right now. Can somebody get can somebody get security to get all this security out of here? <laughs> been listening to the Legion of Skanks podcast with Vic J.O.